So I'm at Caleb's, as you can see. And I was leaving the zombie farm because he didn't have his enchantment table there. And I come up here. And there's just the villager in his bed. And like, I don't know if this is good. So we're gonna block it off. But like, that's my bed for the time being. Sorry, buddy. Don't know if he means to have him, but I also don't want it running away. So we're just going to... The villager was in your bed randomly. I trapped it, Jay. And here we are. Sweeping edge. Bad. I'm going for looting. Three or two. Because I have another looting book. Looting. Looting two. Let's go. I can work with that. I can work with that. Books in here. Looting and mending. Looting two. And then I get looting two and mending. Looting three and mending. And there we go! That's the sword that I'm going to be using. And I got some diamonds here, dude. How much? Nine. Let's go. So, there's this blank wall right by the spawn nether portal that's just stone when the nether portal is like cobble and andesite and looks fancy. So I want to carry that over to the side. So that's what I did. There's also a creeper face, which was the main thing I wanted to add, just because I thought it looked kind of cool. So that's this. And this is what all the hard work looks like after the fact. It's just the portal, and then it all just kind of blends. Hopefully somewhat decent. I'm in the nether fortress, and that's about it. We're going to try and get some blaze rods, because I want an ender chest. I don't have that much food, um, but this, where I am, we're screenshotting that. We're saving that. Someone's been here. I went to their cords, their portal's cords. But I want to get some blaze rods, and I want to see if they left some nether wart. Because if they didn't, they're very disgraceful. Yeah, they built the portal to get out, but it's like, bro, just use your photographic memory. Got it. Let's go. Come on. And this time I've got looting three. How come I don't get a skull in the first batch when I have looting three, but my iron sword can get one no problem? <laughs> I'm a god, dude. Netherward. So much Netherward. I'm thriving! So I kinda did the die, sadly. Um, yeah, I was at a blaze farm, and the blaze smacked me, and then a wither skeleton just teleported behind me, and my career was ended. Now I'm trying to find the way back, and I think I memorized it with my amazing navigational skills. And here we are. Now I need to find the blaze spawner again. And that's gonna be a little bit harder, honestly. Traversing the entire nether in my eyes is e oh, never mind. Well, there goes my like her hyperbole. I got my shit back. We're good. And now that I have half a stack of blaze rods, I don't think I'll need any more in my life. Now I've ran out of food, so I had to come home. We're gonna plant one there. I don't have that much room on my ship, and that causes a lot of things to just be around the ship. Obvious, right? Well, I have a bunch of eggs and almost like no actual meat that I can sustain myself on. Like, I've got this, but these are gonna run out really quick. I'm thinking about building a little crate. What, what if I just put it under the ship? Connect something just straight down here and just have it like underneath the ship just being dragged along. It's probably very inhumane, but it's the best I got for a chicken farm. So that idea was a major bust because fences get waterlogged very easily. I placed the fences, I surrounded all in wood, I got rid of all the water, and then when I went to go break the wood on the outside to just leave the fences as a crate, it all just got waterlogged right back up. Just broke down the whole thing. I gotta go with plan A now, having a little thing above the water. Oh no. You know, just... 
those are all the wrong blocks. And here's what I have. So, hey, get onto it. Is you just jump off the roof. All right, it's that. It's that simple. You go down here, and little cage. Okay. Some chickens. That's where I'm gonna end it. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Don't know why I would. If you did, please subscribe. Very much to my fragile ego, and uh, see you on the next one. Bye.